Texas Tech softball hosting the number one team in the nation with Oklahoma strolling into Lubbock. The Sooners got the scoring started early on Friday as a single brought around the first run of the evening and Chase starter Kara Custer out of the circle and Brittany Talley came on but got a rude welcome to the game as a two run blast to left center put the Sooners up 3-0. OU tacked on another run to go up 4-0 in the first and that would be more than enough for OU's Ricketts as she dominated the entire game, racking up eight strikeouts in her six innings of work. But after going quiet for four innings, the OU offense came back to life, scoring five runs in the top of the sixth, which included two blasts, putting up OU up 9-0. Then in the bottom half of the sixth, after giving up a walk, Ricketts induced a double play to not only enforce the run rule, but to secure a no-hitter against the Red Raiders, the second in as many games against Tech. This, that one as frustrating as uh, the Kansas game. You know, um, you know, you face one of the best pitchers that's ever pitched, one of the most prolific pitchers that's ever pitched, and it's not, you know, we went up there and put the ball in play and, and drew some walks and did some things that if, if we wouldn't have been way behind, we might could have put a little pressure on her and bunt it and, and hit and run. Just tell them, hey, let's, let's go compete. Uh, we got two more chances to go get them. And that's what you got to look at it as, is a great opportunity to go beat the number one team in the nation.